everyone so today we are going to be doing a number tutorial on this type of card layout this uses the caption feature with the gallery element so all the pictures I have used are in the Google Doc even if it doesn't look like it they're there like for example this gray image is gonna be this one the camera and then the other gray image the smaller gray images for the gray image that's here the smaller width one and again since it's a white on white background it doesn't look like it's there but it is this is the notepad and then directly below that should be this little white image which is the size for these galleries we are just going to go ahead and get started
Okay, so for this part, I wasn't really sure how to go about it, but I figured what was easiest is I took a screenshot of this element here and then I cropped it so that it was just the square. And then what I did is I'll leave a link in the description to this site, but I ran it through this website here, completely free to use. You basically just upload the image and it removes the background from it to make it a PNG, like a transparent image. And so once I did all that, I uploaded it here as an image, which I have put the image I used in the Google Doc, just in case you wanna use the same song as me, but obviously you can make your own if you don't wanna use this song. And then I went about cropping it. I played around with this for a while. And then obviously I just adjusted the width And it looks pretty good. You can't really tell that like the quality isn't super bad or anything. And this was um, the closest I could get it to the reference card because I wasn't exactly sure um, what elements they like used or how they went about it. Also, if this, these galleries like in the card dashboard, it might look like they're not touching. Like see, there's a little space there. But once you publish it, they will touch. I don't know why it shows up like this in the dashboard, but once you publish it, everything should look fine. So that's how I did that element. Hopefully it wasn't too confusing. You could also try to, again, do the gallery method with the white image and the caption. I just had problems getting it to be the same width as this image. But yeah, it's up to you guys how you go about it.
uh, ready and here is what the final result should look like. As usual, please let me know if you have any questions or need any help down below. Thank you guys so 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 much for watching and all the support and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye!